When you're working on a business or in life, things will always go wrong. That's the human condition. Look, we've all been quitters, everyone. Nobody's journey is seamless or smooth. We all stumble, we all have setbacks. The question is not if some of these things will happen to you, they will. The question is, what do we do next? You've got to have resiliency. If I don't quit, I can't fail. If I just simply don't quit, I cannot fail. Hold fast. Don't, I know you want to give up. I know you want to quit. I know you're tired, but hold fast. Some days, of course, I'll get tired. Some days, I will get beat up. Some days, I will get knocked down, and I will have some bad days. But I will not stop. This is an everyday gig. Every day is a Monday. And you might not like that. Me, I love it. To me, every day is a beginning. A new day, a new week, a new shot at life. An opportunity to come out of the gate like a man possessed and attack the day without mercy. Today, I'm putting the pressure on. I am the aggressor. I am on the attack. You don't get this far. You don't get to this point and just stop. Most people spend their life not wanting to deal with the pain of rejection, the pain of defeat, the pain of being disappointed, the pain of losing, the pain of failure, the pain of being criticized, the pain of not being liked, the pain, the pain, the pain. That's called life. Now, will it be turbulent? Yes. Will it be easy? No. Will you have some opposition? Yes. Will I make a lot of mistakes? Yes. Will I get hurt? Yeah. But guess what? There's no gain without pain. Don't judge the possibilities for what you can do based upon the circumstances, because the circumstances won't determine who you are. The possibilities for you are unlimited. If you're in a rebuilding process, it's unlimited. If you're coming back from adversity and devastation, it's unlimited of what you can do. Doesn't matter how many mistakes you've made. Doesn't matter how many flops you've had. I see it only as an investment of what you learn from life, of what's possible for you. Struggle, pain, misery, frustration, those are signs that you are on the right path. Nobody that is where you want to be has gotten there without these struggles, without the pain. And if you want to be something great, you are going to have to learn to accept the struggle as part of the recipe. Every single day, you need to look yourself in the mirror and ask yourself, what am I willing to do to get what I want? And if the answer is whatever the fuck I have to, you'll get there in time. It's necessary you take responsibility for it. That you don't make it happen, that you don't give up, that you don't take any objection or disappointment or defeats personally, that you keep on keeping on, that you don't decide that I can't make it because you can't see the light at the end of the tunnel, that you realize that's a part of the program. See, as long as you breathe, you got a shot at your dream. And here's something you've got to resolve. Not over till I get through. Not over till I get over. Not over till I get what I want. You don't care over today, look out. I'm going to come back and take the hinges off. That's how you got to do that. You've got to have that kind of courage, that type of determination. If you want to make it happen, it's you. But you've got to take personal responsibility to make it happen. We can point out many things that can make it inconvenient or can slow us down. But ultimately, it's you. We all want to be a beast, but do you know what a beast is? A beast is someone who can go through hell and be grateful that their legs are working. A beast is someone who's lost everything, but is grateful for the opportunity to get everything back and get even more. A beast is someone who can hit rock bottom and can say, Roger that. I'm gonna harness this sh It is only up from here. I'm gonna come back even stronger.